Lecture 10, Evaporation. Evaporation is a vaporization from the surface of liquid. Rate of evaporation or vaporization is directly proportional to the fusion through boundary layer layers above the liquid. Heat is needed to provide the latent uh, heat of, of, of vaporization and speed up the diffusion through the boundary layer. Evaporator design should be suitable to give maximum heat transfer of to the liquid, largest possible surface area, suitable temperature gradient, boundary layers reduced by all possible means. Factors affecting evaporation. Temperature as number one. As temperature increase, rate of evaporation increase, but thermal pile ma material may be decomposed, so we use evaporation under reduced pressure vacuum. Uh, number two, temperature and external pressure. Reduction in the external pressure decrease boiling points, so used for thermal pile material. Temp temperature as solute concentration and viscosity. As uh, temperature increase, viscosity increase and heat transfer decrease by time. To evaporate viscous liquid, move the liquid either by with gravity or mechanically. Uh, gravity by falling film evaporator, we will see. Mechanically, why wiped film evaporator? Temperature and solubility increase temperature may lead to increase solubility of uh, so higher concentration solution is possible or decrease the solubility of some material like calcium sulfate or magnesium sulfate or even proteins. Turbulent flow condition or scrubber to remove any deposits on the surface of the heating device. Temperature and moisture content increase temperature increase moisture leads to decomposition faster like in belladonna dry extract when we use a uh, raised temperature moisture increase and decomposition of the active constituents occur. Temperature and time of evaporation increase temperature decrease time so no decomposition so we use flash evaporator or uh, climbing film evaporator. Surface area of evaporator used increase surface area increase rate of heat transfer and increase evaporation rate. Evaporation equipment may be classified according to the form of liquid movement to natural circulation evaporator number one, a forced circulation evaporator or film evaporator. Natural circulation evaporator like evaporating band, evaporating still, tube evaporator, either horizontal tube evaporator or vertical tube evaporator. Natural circulating evaporator is a movement of liquid result from convection currents set up by the heating process. The simplest form of natural circulation evaporation is the evaporating pan. Evaporating pan. This consists of an inner pan called the, lin the liner partially involved in an outer pan called the jacket. The two uh, are jointed together so uh, as to enclose a space which, uh, uh, through which steam is buzzed. This is the, the evaporating pan uh, to uh, evaporate the, the liquid put here. Evaporating band may be fixed evaporating pan or tilting evaporating pan. Advantage, it is simple, cheap, easy to use and clean, used for concentration of aqueous and thermostable liquids, but disadvantage is poor circulation, solid will deposit, all liquid heated all the time, so in decrease, increase decomposition of any material used in evaporation. The pan is open, so can't use vacuum, no solvent recovery if the solvent is uh, expensive. Discomfort for workers, slow evaporation rate, Evaporating still is the update of evaporating by by uh, installing a condenser and a pump. This is used of uh, this type of evaporator is widely used in pharmaceutical industry. It is known as a still uh, since it is essentially a vessel, uh, vessel uh, similar to evaporating band with a cover and connects to a condenser with a pump. Advantage like uh, evaporating pan, uh, quite simple uh, to construct, easy to clean. The vapor is condensed, uh, so uh, speed up the evaporation. A receiver and vacuum uh, pump can be fitted to the condenser, permitting operation under reduced pressure, and uh, it is used for thermal pile material. Disadvantage, natural convection only, all the liquor is heated all the time, the heating surface is limited. 
tube evaporator, horizontal tube evaporator, or vertical tube evaporator, like this, horizontal tube evaporator. The feed liquid is introduced in the middle, the feed liquid, from here, to enter the device. Uh, there are pipes of steam uh, to, to uh, heat up the liquid and make it uh, boil to evaporate it. Advantage, relatively low initial cost, require low head room and are easy to install. They can be used either as a batch or continuous evaporator. Disadvantage, poor liquor circulation in all of them. Unsuitable for viscous liquid, unsuitable for liquor that is crystallized on concentration. Like mag magnesium sulfate or calcium sulfate. Short tube evaporator. Like this. Advantage, the use of tubular calendria increase the heating area largely, the vigorous circulation reduce the boundary layer and scrap any solids separating us from the concentrated liquid, thus vertical tube evaporators are suitable for liquid which will crystallize in on concentration. Uh, it is used in sugar in industry. They can be used uh, as po both as patch or continuous evaporator. Um, we may install a condenser, a receiver, and a vacuum pump. Disadvantage: the plant is more, much more complicated, making it expensive, difficult in cleaning and maintenance. Uh, the liquor, the heat of liquor, the heat of liquor increase pressure at the bottom, uh, elevation of boiling point, uh, which may be uh, lead to serious problems, like explosion. Forced circulation evaporator. Uh, in this form, we use mechanical agitation as a form to uh, overcome the natural circulation evaporator problems. Flash evaporator like this. The liquor is circulated by means of a pump so as to, uh, it is under pressure in the tube. Uh, so the boiling point is elevated and no boiling take place as the liquor leave the, the tubes and enter the body of the, the evaporator, there is a drop in pressure and the vapor flash off the superheated liquid. Advantage, forced circulation enable higher degree of concentration to be achieved, uh, used in viscosity or uh, uh, in, in viscous liquids. In addition, liquors can uh, with a tend to frost or foam readily. Forced circulation of operation are particularly suitable for operation under reduced pressure. Used it may be used for thermolapile materials. C. Uh, film evaporators like Lily film evaporator. One of the first film evaporator is the Lily film evaporator. The liquid is be evaporated is sprayed as a film over a series of horizontal tubes heated internally by steam. This is Lily film evaporator. In uh, the material uh, is sprayed here on uh, hot steam tubes. And we take the feed here uh, after evaporation. Climbing film evaporator. The liquor to be evaporated is introduced into the bottom of the tube from here. The liquor enter from here and go out from here after evaporation in this thin, long, very long tubes. Uh, these tubes may be six meters length. At the upper in the mixture of vapor and concentrated liquid enter a cyclone separator, the vapor passing on to a condenser and the concentrate to a receiver. Uh, this is how uh, the, fi the film climb. The velocity of film may be uh, uh, 6 to 7 meters second. Advantage uh, the very high film velocity reduce boundary layers to uh, a minimum giving improved heat transfer. The use of long narrow tubes provide large area for heat uh, transfer. Because of increased efficiency of heat transfer, small temp temperature difference is sufficient uh, with re uh, less risk of damage of thermal pile material. Short contact time, about uh, one second. So uh, it is used for thermal piles. 
Although the tubes are very long, they are not submerged as a short tube evaporator, so that there is no elevation on boiling point due to hydrostatic heat. Disadvantage expans expensive to manufacture, difficult to clean and maintain since the replacement of the tubes require headroom clearance of further 7 meters. The feed rate is critical. If too high, concentration will be insufficient. If too low, the, the film can't be maintained and drying may form on the tube wall. It is used successfully for the concentration of solutions such as insulin, liver extracts, and vitamins. Uh, number three, falling film evaporator. It is like a uh, climbing film evaporator, but uh, the cyclone is down or in, is the bottom. This is an alternative form of long uh, tube evaporator, which resembles a climbing film evaporator, but it is inverted. It is used for viscous liquid. Used for viscous liquids. Horizontal tube evaporator. Uh, operate a similar principle as a climbing film evaporator but overcome the difficulty of replacement uh, of 7 meters long tubes and the necessity of high head room. In this type several pairs to uh, 2.5 meters long tubes are joined together in a series. Wiped film evaporator is a form of film evaporator coming in increase as the use of a wiped film evaporator or rotary film evaporator. It is used for two viscous liquid. It is used for two viscous liquid. Thank you.